Good evening, everybody. I hope that you are all well. Getting off to a flying start tonight because I am completely cream crackered and going to run from nine to 11 and then I'm stopping. I promised myself I'm stopping at 11 o'clock tonight. How often have you heard me say that? And I don't do it um, as the week's getting on. I'm getting more and more tired. So uh, I need to try and be awake for the big event tomorrow, which is tomorrow. We're going to be joining uh, Jackie Detona for the STCC Championship, the first of 12 races to be run over six weeks. And I cannot wait. I am ever so slightly nervous. Um, I never do well in these sorts of events. Um, but with the practice that we've done this week, I'm hoping that I might be able to actually finish a race without crashing. We shall see. We shall see. So in the YouTube at the moment, we've got uh, Captain 420, Gamer Dan, Galactic Core, Orbalate is in, Welsh Boy, MZ, Jenky, Jackie is in, Reese has just joined. Welcome, welcome, welcome to you all. And in the room, which is already filling up really quickly, we've got uh, Gamer Dan, myself, Mad Mikey, Aid. Uh, oh, Rof, it's just moved, as I was about to say that one. Rof Hartsfield. Orbalator, GT Tom and Reese. I think that was everybody. Uh, I'm imagining a few people in here are going to be using the GR4 car that are going to be running tomorrow. They're basically British Touring Car liveries um, on the choice of GR car as defined by the guys that are hosting this. So my car is actually the Sylvia Spec R, but it's on a Peugeot 406 livery, Tim Harvey's livery. So it's a bit strange, the fact that my livery is Peugeot sitting on Sylvia. But the Sylvia actually is a car that I was a bit apprehensive about at the beginning of the week. Uh, but I've grown to like it. It's relatively forgiving. Um, and hopefully, hopefully, hopefully it will be. OK, that's what I'm really, really hoping for. Good evening, Aid. Um, so I'm going to get this one underway fairly quickly tonight. Uh, then we get into a few little randomizer races and then we'll go from there. I've got um, a busy day tomorrow and a busy weekend as well. So, uh, yeah, I'm hoping to try and get a slightly earlier night tonight. Catch up on some much needed sleep. And one or two of you have contacted me just recently to say uh, that the a couple of you are taking a bit of a break from racing in the evening this late because you're getting tired. And a lot of us are at that age where we do need to catch up with some of the old Zeds. Um, MZ, been focusing hard on my schoolwork these days. Looking forward to the weekend. Me too, my friend. Um, Nintendo, I am driving the Sylvia Specar Aero. I'm going to pop that screen over in a minute and you'll be able to see. Basically, it's a GR or car um jackie had to have a last minute car swap with orbalator who's now in the alan menu inspired attenza what is this about swapping cars who said we could swap cars god i fancy going in the um what do i can you put me in the the red bull 2019 please um with the um what should we have? I guess it would be need to be the Max Verstappen livery. Um, I think that would be good. If you can make that happen for me, Jackie, then um yeah, that'll make my that'll make my day. That'll make my day. <laughs> um well, Blady says if I'd had the 155, I would have kept it. <laughs> That's not a problem, my friend. I don't mind. Who runs what? You know, it's just all the competition and taking part that counts. Um and um so yeah that that will be that will be good it's nice as well that uh jackie's um accommodating you orb which is nice it's nice um oh the yeah, alpha it's a legend shot one ah that explains it that explains it no i appreciate you accommodating orb later jackie thank you for that he's a, he's a lovely guy and um i'd have been really disappointed if he hadn't been able to run purely because of the car so i appreciate you accommodating him um and i would have, I'd have gladly swapped um I, i've got used to this car so i'm a bit reluctant to swap right now 
Um, but if anybody does need to swap, I'm not the fastest in the room. I would be relatively happy to swap if necessary. Edinburgh lad, good evening. Good evening. Good evening. As always, guys, please keep it respectful this evening. Um, if you do bump somebody, please just simply give the place back by an apology and then just just explain what happened in the chat and we will all be friends. As always, if you could put at PlayStation Racer in the chat, it will put an orange box around my name and then I'll know that you are trying to get my attention, especially if I'm racing, because I'm trying and I'm not always doing it. Sometimes I fail. I'm trying not to look at the chat whilst I'm racing because it does result in, in too many incidents although there are times when i can look at the chat like the straights i'm trying to get used to doing that um kuva what's up my friend what's up um what's up over here we're just doing some racing we're going to be going out around brands hatch in the gr4 cars in preparation for tomorrow and um i am going to be starting the quality on this one uh at um 21 21 10 regardless i want to actually get on with this one tonight because it was quite a late start yesterday um I didn't mind too much yesterday because we had obviously the manufacturers was on and a lot of people were doing that. But we're up to 11 already in this one. And uh, yeah, it'll be good to get going. We've already got a few people doing donuts, so they'll be anxious to get going pretty quickly. So we're going to get going in four minutes, guys. Four minutes, less than that, just under four minutes. And we will be running at 21.10. Um, with that in mind, I am going to try and hit the track because, as you guys well know, it always takes me a couple of laps to just settle myself down. And very often when I'm streaming, I'm not actually doing any of that. Uh, I tend to just jibber jabber, just jump in and then just go straight into the quali and um, normally mess it up pretty, pretty well. And... Let's turn the wheel on. That just might help. So I hope everybody is well. I have come out on the hard tyres for the moment because I just want to just get to grips with this on the hard tyres. Those are the ones I'm going to be starting off on. Greg White, good evening, my friend. Nintendo, you asked me that a moment ago. It's the uh, Nissan Silvia. Hi, Mr. Theatre. Oh. As you can tell, completely missing the apexes right now. Just got two minutes. just going to do probably get this lap done and another one car sliding around all over the place on these uh, hard tires oh yes my friend it's time for some fun we've got two hours of hard fair racing coming up at least what I hope is going to be hard on fair racing. Got cars lining up to watch me go by. <laughs> or to watch me spin, one or the other. Let's just see where we are with competitors. Wow, we're up to 13 already. So we've got Kushti's in the room, Greg White's in the room, Gamer Dan is in the room, Jenki, 
I had some awesome racing with Jenki yesterday. Brilliant racing. Edinburgh lads in. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, I am in um, Ara Vancouver. Mad Mikey, Aid, Reese. Ara of Hartsfield, Orbalator, GT Tom, Malkovich, and Tater. Quite a few people in here already. We're 15 out of 16. And I said I was going to start it at 21.10. I am going to start it at 21.10. I'm just waiting for Tater. I don't really want to cut him out if I can help it. But I am going to get this one going very, very, very quickly. Uh, it was a very late start yesterday. And I don't particularly want a late, late start today. So we've got people from Britain, Canada, Belgium, USA, quite a few. Right. I said I wasn't going to wait. I'm just giving Tater a few moments. And then I am going to go, oh, Hartsfield is just changing cars. Better be quick. That's 16 to 16 in a room now. We should be on a friend's room. Well, we've got a lot of RR guys in here. I'm just waiting for good guy, good guy to grab a car. And then we are going. Looks like he has already. Right, here we go then. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, we've got a few different names in here tonight. This is going to be interesting. Hello, Kuro. Wintergreen. Good evening, good evening, good evening to you all. Right, let's see how we go in this one. Uh, whack the old um, helps if you put the right tyres on Mitchell Good evening Faz, yeah I think this one's proving to be very very popular this week oh, Going too wide on that one again With regard to this one, I'm happy to drop into the randomizer after this, or I'm happy to run this three or four times on the trot just so that we can get practicing for tomorrow. And uh, one of the things I'd like to do, and I don't know how I can work it, is to prioritize those that are racing tomorrow.
That may well be a very difficult thing for me to do though. Bearing in mind, I haven't got a list to hand of those people that are racing. I just was not expecting this many people in the room this early in the proceedings. That's a 132, we really need to be down in the 130s for this to stand any chance tomorrow. Wow, Jackie got a 29 1 earlier. Oh, that's so fast. That is silly, silly fast. I cannot go nowhere near that. Oh, of course, Greg. Thank you, Greg. It does you getting out of the way. <laughs> Whoa, what did we get into? So 1.3 seconds off the pace at the moment, but still plenty of people running. Mag Mikey smashing it again out in front. Mr. Theatre, sorry room is full. These rooms, I tell you what, I used to get full on a Friday. These rooms are getting really full really quick now. So much so that I'm actually doing a heads up on Discord to let my regular guys on Discord know when the room is going live. I think we've got a lot of friends of friends in here tonight. A lot of new names. Uh, Kuro, I think you'll find the QT kinds times will be closer on a lot of cars on the grid on Friday. I think you could be right. I'm hoping so. I am hoping so. Also, I don't know if the conditions are exactly the same as we are running. Things could be slightly different tomorrow. Uh, I'm very much aware of that. Um, but hey ho, we'll see how things go. At the moment, I'm sitting in seventh place. 1.6 seconds off of the pace now. Uh, Mad Mikey with a 129.1 so uh, Jackie Daytona's got a 29.4 so um, pretty quick times in here pretty quick times so we've got Mad Mikey Greg White Gamer Dan Kushti Edinburgh Lad Reese, then me then Jenki Malkovich Aid Orbalator Vancouver Good Guy Casper GT Tom Tater 
and Hartsfield bringing up the rear. And you'll notice, guys, look at this. I am right up with Jenky again. It's going to be another, another complete battle between Jenky and myself. I can see it coming. I can see it coming. This is going to be a complete rerun of yesterday, I think. I had to pull a rather audacious move on Jenky yesterday. We did touch on the way through. Slight bump of doors. But it was declared OK. And... Um, Wintergreen wanted to run the AR4C so bad. Didn't have the hards and softs. Love how he says my name, Tater. I don't. How do you pronounce it? Is it is it Tater, Tata? You'll have to tell me how to to pronounce it phonetically. <laughs> right. Let's uh, let's quiet down. This is where we now need to really start getting this to grips with this. Whoa! Very slow away. I blinked as the lights went. Still got dirty tyres. Whoa, there's a bit of barging going on there. Well, not barging, just a little bit of bumping, as is often the case through that first corner. I've got a drag with Orbalator, he's right alongside me. the fifth at the moment aim it down way way out front a long old way out front oh we're going a bit deep into there had to stay off the accelerator a lot longer than I would have liked on these uh, hard tyres, just need to keep it a little bit tight. I'm just trying not to let those cars in front get away too far. They're already two and a half seconds away. Hey Frontier, we're doing okay my friend. Well we lap two. Get two more on these then we'll ditch them. At the moment I just want to try and stay with these two in front. A little bit deep through there. Looks like Gamer Down and Reese are getting away up front. At the moment, of course, we don't know what strategies people are on. Oh, I've got a slide there. 
big old slide under acceleration. a little bit out of my comfort zone going through some of these corners at the moment just trying to stay with these two one more one more oh Greg going for a move on Kushti Holding these two about one and a half to two seconds. Obviously, I don't know which what tyres these two are on in front. I suspect I know what tyres Christie's on. I, I tried the fourth gear trick through there that didn't work all right gonna do my usual trick of just over fueling ever so slightly go Remember what Jack was telling me last night about the gears. Just trying to put that into practice as well tonight. just up ahead 
He's in the same car as me, I think. Sorry for the lack of chat, guys. I am seriously concentrating tonight. Got to give Aid some room on the inside there. Not easy to do two cars side by side through there. I've got to get on with this. way off GT Tom at the moment nine seconds but I don't know who's pitting who hasn't pitted so I'm just going to keep on pushing see how we go oh nearly Christy chasing me down now. He's got some free air now, so he's going to be shifting.
hoping to uh, use Christy as a ghost car and just chase him but uh, he's just too quick for me he's right on the back of Reese. Christy making a move. Christy's got the inside for that one. That's going to be that move done. They weren't fighting quite as long as I hoped they were going to be fighting for. Reese has got a half second. Thank you, Reese. Now that's respect. That is respect. He knows he's got a half second penalty. He's released me to go after Kushti. Thank you so much, Reese. Christie's just easing away at the moment. Game of Dan's way out in front. Tyre's looking good, Buell's looking good. Christy just easing away little bit by little bit. I've got Greg White is chasing me down too. I've got a fast guy in front, I've got a fast guy behind. We got blue flags flying and for once they're not for me.
Oh, Christy's gone round. No. Has he had an issue with somebody? Guys, what happened there? Thank you. Oh, my heart is beating out of my chest right now. Oh, a bit of a slide there. It's going to let Greg get closer. Where's Greg? Don't throw it away on the last corner, Mitchell. Yes. Yes. Whoa! Second place. Oh, my word. Oh, my word. Oh, I've decided, Jackie, that I'm putting this... Well, that, that's the race for tomorrow. Done. Finished. That's it. We're done. <laughs> we don't need to run tomorrow anymore. <laughs> oh, my word. Woo! With people like Gamer Dan, Greg White, Malkovich, Aid, Jenky, Kusty. Edinburgh my lad's not slow either. Whoa! <laughs> Get in there! Whoa. Only Ball, good evening. Jack Goby, good evening. Everybody I haven't said to hello this evening. Hello, 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 hello to you all. Oh my word. I ought to pack up and finish that right there. I think I need to pack that in right there. Uh, Reese, I had no fight with that Scooby on hards. Oh, I tell you what, Reese, Kuro doesn't like that Scooby either. I had a close call. Because I wanted the Subaru or the Mitsubishi. Those two cars were drawn just after my car. And I tell you what, this Sylvia is awesome. I've changed a couple of things on the car tonight. And uh, wow, what a difference. What a difference. So Gamer Dan in first with a 129.8. Looks, well, I'm not going to say the only one in the 129s. We'll come to that in a minute. I got second. Yes, I got second. Sorry. It doesn't often happen. I'm just enjoying it. 130.6. Yes. Uh, Greg White in third. He was chasing me down really quick. 125, 129.5. I could just see him getting closer and closer and closer. Malkovich in fourth. Aid in fifth. Jenky in sixth. Reese in seventh. GT Tom in eighth. Edin Vlad in ninth. Good guy Casper in tenth. Orbalator in eleventh. Vancouver in 12th, Hartsfield in 13th, uh, Kushti, I don't know what happened, uh, he was chasing and chasing and chasing and I was chasing him and uh, something must have happened but he got 129.3, so he was the other car in the 129s as was Mad Mikey and 
Tata or Tata, um, who were a couple of DNFs. So it was a real shame that Kushti didn't make the end of that one. Um, but your top three, and I'm going to savor this, Gamer Dan, a huge 10 seconds behind. A certain person called Mitchell Morgan. That's something you don't hear very often. Uh, Greg White in third, just two tenths of a second behind me. So, so, so close. Wow. So your top three, Gamer Dan, me and Greg White. Whoa. My word. My word, my word, my word. Oh, uh, Jenky, a bit pushy in that race early on. Yeah, it was a bit bumpy. Uh, Jonesy, good evening. Um, Kuro says, kick whoever made Kush crash. No, 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 no. No, I'm going to give that guy a medal. <laughs> Guys, if you see blue flags, then be aware of the cars coming up behind and stay off the racing line. I have to say, Kushti, I did flash my lights at somebody who was on blues when I saw what happened to you. I don't, I never, ever flash my lights. And I did tonight to say I was coming up. Um, oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. That was crazy. So my question to you guys is, do we want to go randomizer or do you want to do a few more of these tonight? Um, if I can get the word randomizer or brands for your decision on what you would like to do. Um, and um, I can't even remember who the DNS were actually. But I do... So would you get um well I don't want to keep Mad Mikey because that was unusual. And um the only other DNF was was Tater. Um But we have got Vancouver and Hartsfield who are not in the chat as far as I am aware. Um so yes. It's difficult to know who to kick. It really is. Um it really is. Uh, so Gamer Dan's gone randomizer. Oh, Coover Brothers Vancouver. Okay, yeah. So this is the thing is, um, quite a few people like Vancouver, forgive me, I, I couldn't remember the name, uh, but Vancouver has run with us several times. Um, Kuro, do you want to do one more of these for t for a, a practice tomorrow, or do you want to go uh, random? Thank you, guys, for those of you that are making way. Okay, it looks like we're going to go randomizer. So let me just flick across to the randomizer. Um, we will be doing that one again. We're going to be doing that race again at half past 10. For those of you that would like to run it, we will run that again at half past 10. But now I'm going to run the randomizer. Um, this will get a few people leaving. And a few of the diehards will stay in. Uh, this is one that we have not done previously. This one is in the randomizer, but it's not one that we've signed off on, guys. Um, so we're looking for the Camaro SS16 or the Mustang GT15 on this particular one. And you are going to need mechanical damage. I'm going to set that to light. Um, Tire wear is two and two. Looks like a straight run. And we are looking at all sports tires. Oh, here we go. I'm going to get into a situation where I can't change it. Uh, 33. 
OK. Kuva. No, nope. we're looking for a Camaro or the Mustang on this one. And now we're going to find out those that are listening and those that aren't. If there's any of you that would like to do GR4 and 3, maybe shout it out in the track in the chat, because I've noticed that um, Kushti was running with us and I know he likes to run the GR cars rather than these weird and wacky ones that we run from time to time. Um, and I don't know if he is open to opening up a lobby and I am maybe putting him on the spot a little bit here. Um, but yeah. Kushti, have you just opened the lobby, my friend? I think he may well have done. OK, Kushti has just opened the lobby, guys. So if you would rather go and run. Are you doing GR races, Kushti? I'm suspecting he is. If you'd rather do GR races rather than randomised stuff, then um, Kushti has just opened up a, a lobby. Um, let me just come down to the Fords. You'll be able to find Kushti under um, Kushti Racing. If you guys are struggling to find him. So I'm going to be running randomised races now until half past ten when we'll drop back in and we'll rerun that. Um, hopefully. Hopefully Kushti saved that one. Uh, so you've now got two channels, two lobbies that are open to you now, guys. You can either stick with me doing random stuff or you can hop across to Kushti Racing where he'll be doing GR4, GR3 stuff on various tracks. Thank you, Dan. Good evening, my friend. Thank you for uh, the reminder about smashing the like button. Please smash the like button if you haven't already. That would be absolutely fantastic. Uh, Kuro, I'll jump back in for the STC races, but I'm going to go support Kush Lobby now. Absolutely no problem at all, my friend. Um, you can you can leave me, Kush, uh, Kuro, on one condition that you beat Kushti at least three times in the next hour. At least three times. When you come back, I expect you to tell me that you have beaten him. Uh, that's assuming that you're staying in my chat, of course. You may want to be. I might have lost you already. Who knows? Um, Matt, can you do seven laps mediums later? We have that to do, too. I haven't done that one yet. Um, Matt, remind me after this race and we'll go do it. We will go do it. Because I think that one's just a straightforward sprint race, isn't it? There's no no pitting or anything in that one from memory um but remind me after this race and we will go do that uh, so qualifier at uh, 21 when should we do this one 2156 so can i just remind everybody that uh, i am doing sort of random stuff until about half past 10 although we will be doing a specific request in a moment um, Kushti over on his channel, Kushti Racing, is hosting GR, primarily GR races. So if you want some serious racing with some top runners, then uh, he's running those right now. And uh, we've lost nearly half the room, so it looks like it's nicely split, which is good. Um, so I'm assuming that the two are our guys are going and grabbing cars and on this one we need to be running um sport tires so let me just make sure i'm on sport softs it should be fine uh, typically with these braking in a straight line is all important and as usual i spent most of my time managing the channel and not out there racing um rr and are you racing Uh, good guy Casper is uh, just coming back in as well. 
Uh, Wintergreen, if you look for Cushti Racing, then you'll find it. Or if you click on Cushti's name in the chat, I think that will also enable you to find it. If you click on Cushti Racing's name in the chat, you might have to scroll back a little bit, uh, but you should be able to find it that way. Um, well, actually, 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 we have got on the tyres for this one um, required. We do need to be running the mediums. We need to be running the mediums. So I think I am going to go for the sports medium on this one and hedge my bets. Otherwise, people are going to need to pit. The only thing, Wintergreen, is if um, you might need to be a friend of Kushti's. People need to be a friend for me uh, to run in my lobbies. And I don't know if Kushti's are friends as well. So you might need to send a friend request to him. Unless you're a friend of any of the other guys, in which case you should be able to find it that way. And if you can't, come back and join us. Yes, Kushti is live at the moment. Kushti is live at the minute. I'm just checking on the phone. I right, say so he is live. Wintergreen, are you a friend of mine? If not, send me a friend request. I'll, I'll accept it. And then you should be able to find Kushti by going into the lobbies and then clicking on um, lobbies with friends. Wintergreen, send me one as well. Guys, we will get racing in a moment. Uh, I'm just doing a, a little bit of admin for the moment and then we'll get going. Um, He's not picking up. He may well be racing. Okay. I was just going to give him a call and see if uh, we could get him to pick up uh, and check. Hello. Yeah, just a quick one. You've got um, a guy, Wintergreen, is trying to friend request you so we can get in your lobby. Magic. Okay, cheers. See you. Bye. Oh, God, we're all working together tonight. All right, I'm just waiting for Reese to join us and then we will be on our way. Oh. So I'm just waiting for Reese and then we'll go. Uh, Wintergreen is in with um, Christy now. Okay, let's uh, let's get this one underway, shall we? Now, I haven't done any quali. I haven't done any practice, so I don't know how I'm going to run in this race. It could be all over the shop. We shall see, but we are starting to qualify in now. Um, John, I think you may well have used caps or too many symbols again, my friend. I uh, haven't got an opportunity to dive in there and have a look. Um... No, I've got no brake balance on this one, on this car. Looks like I need to buy a brake balancer. Ooh. 
Whoa. Boy, oh boy, these things are slippery. Let's just... Boy, these things slide around all over the shop. Where, where, where do you break for this corner? <laughs> Completely out of control. So, the rule of thumb here is work out where you think you need to break and then break about 30 foot before. Hi Jack, good evening my friend. We've got two lobbies open tonight if you're racing. Uh, I'm running randomizer stuff, although we're going to be heading off for a GR4 run around Brands Hatch in a minute that's been requested and uh, Kushti is running primarily GR4 and GR3 stuff this evening whoa well that's how to do a 360 but it'd be nice if we could keep it on the black stuff Whoa, this car, you've really got to slow it down early. Okay, we're in quality at the moment, then we'll just be doing a short race, about 10 minutes, and then we'll be opening up another one. So uh, feel free to jump in the room and spectate this one. Give me some commentary on the way round. Let me know how everybody in front is doing so well, because I'm going to be last in this one. Are there many people over in Christie's room? Oof. God, this car just does not want to turn. Mind you, I'm asking Christie, uh, Kuro, he's probably racing. Eight so far, cool. That's fine. I'm very, very, very interested to see how this um, double lobby is going to work tonight. Because I was way oversubscribed for the first race. <clears throat> and a lot of my regular guys that I'd like to have been in the room weren't in. So Christie's kindly opened up another lobby where he's running more serious GR stuff. Uh, that doesn't mean to say we're not serious what we're doing in here, but here we're running all sorts of different cars, not just GR cars. So you never quite know what you're going to get. You could get everything from a, from a cart to a truck to a van. GR4s, GR3s, 2s, 1s. Mustangs, Camaros, GTs, Ferraris, a whole load of stuff. This is the channel and the lobby where we really just more enjoy the cars that we don't get to run very often. And very often, as we're doing now, 
on sports tyres the way these cars should be driven. Well, I say the way they should be driven. Um, the way that some of the guys in here can drive them and I can't. Hello, John. Attempt number... Yeah, I'm not going to read that out. <laughs> uh, yeah, avoid avoid the capitals, my friend. So who have we got in this one? We've got GT Tom, Hartsfield, Speedy B, myself, Reese, Jenky. We're all in Mustangs. Mad Hatter's in the Camaro. Jones is in the Mustang. Gamer Dan's in the Camaro. Greg White's in the Camaro. And Jackie Boy is spectating for the moment. Let's just get into this one, start the race and see how we go. Um, you weren't even writing in caps and you got the screenshot. Ooh, why does the quality time need adjusting? We normally do a five minute quality time, unless it's um, Nordschleifer or Le Mans. I know sometimes it only gives you a one lap flyer but that's the way we roll here. Now I haven't got a brake balancer on here, which is a real pain. I want to put some brake bias to the rear. Yeah, that happens sometimes, Jonesy. That does happen sometimes. Very often it's just a single flyer. Otherwise, sometimes <coughs> we get into qualifiers or as long as the race. And we want to try and keep it moving forwards as much as we can oh speedy b's going around it's going to cause a roadblock there I'm into the wall again. This car is really hard to drive. A little bit like that Impreza we were running the other day. Like, get it slowed down in a straight line and then get up through the gears as quick as you can. Even though the back end is stepping out on me all the time. I'm going to let that car back through. I just put him into the barrier. Jenky, why didn't you go by me? Oh!
This is hard. This is hard, hard, hard work. <laughs> Some of the guys up the front are making this look super easy. Mad Hatter and Gamer are gone. There's, there's got to be a knack to driving these cars on sports tyres that I am yet to crack. Can I catch up with Jenky? certainly see those people that can drive these and those people that struggle speedy b's got a nice run on me No traction control. No traction control for me is going to be horrendous. Yeah, I think a lot of it is not getting in the slides. I bet he's braking super, super early. I might actually check the replay on this one later on. Just go one. way way off the pace you can see how much I struggle with these cars have you raised those super bees what are the super bees I guess the answer to that question is no because I'm I'm not quite sure what car you or what car you're referring to Oh, it's a dodge. Oh. I struggle with a lot of the American cars. Short answer is no. I really, really struggle with those. I mean, I've, I've driven them a few times. But 
but those 1960s, 70s, beautiful American muscle cars, they really take some driving. Atta lad, whee! <laughs> Oh, Hartsfield just into the grass there. That's enabled me to close up a little bit. Can we get a place back, I wonder? I think I've got a lot to learn from Mad Hatter driving these cars. That is the beauty of the replay, being able to load up somebody's car and ride on board with them and watch how they race. Oh, did I run him into the wall? It's not fair if I run him into the wall. That's not a clean pass. Couldn't actually see him there. I haven't got my radar on, that's why. Oh no, come on, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. That's going to let him back through. Left in room that time. Oh, this is a drag to the line. <laughs> Got that one. <laughs> Whoa, that was tight. Wow. <laughs> Just over one hundredth of a second. Wow. That was hard. Hard, hard, hard. The Titanic handle better than that Mustang. That's a tough one, that is. Uh, a lot of the time, shift down to second to slow the car down, then back to third. Less tail happy. I was starting to do that, but what I need to do is I need a lesson from our friend up front on that one. So I'm going to save the replay on that and we'll have a nose because Mad Hatter in first place with a 206.9 is your winner. Gamer Dan in second with a 207.0. Greg White in third with a 208.5. Jenky with a fine four. Threes with a fifth. I got sixth. Hartsfield in seventh. Speedy B in eighth. Jonesy ninth. And GT Tom tenth. So your top three Mad Hatter, Gamer Dan, and Greg White. Congratulations to the three of you. All right. I had a request. I had a request um, to run this one seven laps I think it was uh, who, who asked me to do the um, to do the sprint race at Brands um, I need to know the the details of it um, 
BOP setting slipstream lights. Is the tire wear still six to six? Is it still 65 litres? I think I heard somebody say that it was medium tyres. I'm not quite sure if I'm setting this up properly. Okay, I'm going to go with that and just see how we go. So I've got the same tyre wear, same fuel consumption rate. Although it's only supposed to be a sprint race. So I don't know what the details are for it. Well, I thought I had a friend request in there, but it seems to have disappeared. I'm very confused. Good guy, Casper. I, I thought I just accepted your request, but it seems to have disappeared. Um, I might just run this one. Who was asking about? Who was asking about? about doing a sprint race. Uh, trouble is, my chat goes through so quickly, it's hard to keep up with it. Bear with me a second, guys. cannot find it right now okay see what I'm gonna do we'll, we'll go back to another randomizer one and we'll come back to that idea a little later um, oh we got another unusual one we have room number 29 room number 29 now this one for you guys we might have a problem with the cars so i might have to scrap this one and go with a different car um or you can grab something that's close but what we should be in is a shelby gt350 so we've got uh the randomizer is favoring the mustangs tonight it seems hoping that um, Grand Turismo holds out for us tonight. It's been a lot of problems today with the Sony servers or the PlayStation servers. Um, I'm hoping that we're all going to be good. At the moment, guys, I'll just go back to the PlayStation window I am struggling at the moment and it looks like it's either being prepared and slow or we have got an issue and I'm not quite sure which it is. I don't really want to exit if I can help it. Because if I do exit, I'm going to kick everybody out of the room. I don't think that's doing anything, personally. I might have to come out and redo this one, guys.
Oh. We're actually we're we're going. Um, looks like that may well have just been somebody locking the room, uh, possibly. But we do look like we are up and running again. Uh, um, I am looking for. Oh, it's a Shelby. Not a Ford, it's a Shelby. Oh, which one should we go for? Right, it'd be interesting to see who's got this car. Uh, because we've got some notes on this one. What notes have we got? Okay, so you should have Whoop, not that one where is it where is it where is it i'm going to make a quick change to this room um we're going to go boost strong. The slipstream is also strong. Mechanical damage is light. And we are going to take off. Right, going to save the settings. This is number 29. This is getting me all out of kilter again now. Ah. Thankfully I saved that. Let's just give this another go. Load settings 29. Just making a few little changes to this one, guys. Should be at the top. Okay, uh, those were a couple of requests that were made. Um, when we ran this one last time. So made those quick changes. We'll see how we go. Viewpoint looks a bit wrong. Uh, Mr. Theatre, anything close? Whatever you've got, if you go into your car, see what's not flashing. I think it could do with a bit of a, a beef up on the gearbox, yeah. Yep, I would think so. If you get the opportunity to buy this car guys when it's in the uh, dealerships grab it
Right, let's, uh, when are we going to get this one underway? We're going to get this one underway at uh, qualifier at uh, 2022 even. 22.34. Just a couple of minutes guys and we're going to go running. Okay, we've just made some uh, to send guy. I think that this is a car that you can only get in the legend. It's not expensive, um, so you may well need to find a car that is similar. I need to change I need to buy the gearbox which I can't do unfortunately I need to grab a uh, one of the other gearboxes I might that'd be fine that will be fine yeah Mad Mikey I think that's about right I'm not mentioning car costs because a lot of the car costs have gone through the roof I bought the CLK the other day eight and a half million credits up from six I'm sure the last time I saw it for sale, it was six million and I didn't have the cash. It absolutely wiped me out. Um, oh, Jonesy's got a white body. No. Oh, why do we go with the white bodies, guys? Only ball can't get in. Five seventy one. Why can only is yours wide body as well? Because you should be get you should be able to get in a five seventy one sixty. I'm at five seventy two and I'm in. I'm suspecting that Ernie's is a white body. No, it's not. Why can you not get in then? What's your horsepower and your weight? I want to get Ernie in. I've got a really fast one of these, but I can't drive it. I'm just waiting on Ernie Ball and Mr. Theatre. Uh, tyres. Uh, um, I've got Racing Soft on the... Um, and I've got a funny feeling a lot of people are going to say that they want to go with the... Uh, yeah, Racing Soft tyres is what I've got set. 309. Ah, horsepower's too high. And the weight. How come your car is that high on the weight? It's obviously not standard. It's 
So what are we on? 573 is fine. Three oh nine, and your weight. So your weight is fine. You just take that down a bit. I'm gonna actually go. I'm gonna go racing on this one. Just a, sorry guys, I'm just adjusting the stats for Ernie. Uh, Ernie's machine is obviously not quite stock. John, what are the stats on your car? Ernie's in in the Cosworth. Ah, oh, was it the Cosworth that you were trying to get in with? I thought we might have trouble with this car. It's a brilliant car. I love it. Um, but I did think there may well be an issue with a few people not having it. All right, I'm just going to wait for these guys to grab cars and then we'll be in. So I'm just waiting on Jonesy, Mr. Theatre and Speedy B. That Cosworth is going to be blindingly quick around here. We've got a couple of them in Cosworths. I want to do a Cosworth evening. By the way, I've put a list of vehicles that are in the randomizer in the Discord. So you can have a look and see what we've got in there at the moment. And I am more than happy to add more, especially some of the classics. Just as Mad Mike is saying there, there's loads more classics that come up in the used car dealership that we could use. And they are a lot cheaper also. And I'm more than happy to drop a few of those in. Uh, there's some cracking cars in there. I added in a couple of the old, uh, the old Subaru and the old Mitsubishi the other day two brilliant cars brilliant brilliant cars right um i am going to get this going very 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 soon um so i'm going to go qualifier at um 2241 whether people are ready or not so you've got just under a minute and then we're going jonesy you're going to need to be quick my friend uh, the sim guy's system is updating. Uh, Mr. Theatre is going to spectate. Not a problem. Uh, so let's get this one underway. Uh, is Jonesy in? Yes, he is. Do you know what I fancy? I fancy the Cosworth around Day Daytona Oval. I think that'd be fun. Or Mad Mikey, that would be wicked. I'm, I'm actually looking forward. You've mentioned this before. Um, I would really, really look forward to that. Uh, does Sim Guy, are we, we racing or just for fun? We're racing, but it's always a bit for fun around here because obviously um, we're running different cars. Uh, they're not necessarily all exactly the same. So it's a little bit fun and a little bit racing. If you want some serious racing, the sim guy, Kushti, Kushti Racing is running GR races in, alongside my lobby. So if you want to get into some serious racing, pop across and see Kushti. Tell him I sent you over. And um, yeah, they're doing some serious GR stuff over there at the moment. And I did say at half past 10, I was going to go back into the brand stuff so this is probably going to be oh, I'm going to do this one and one more after this
that was a bit of a big slide. That was a bit naughty on Game of Dan, if I'm honest. One point four two minutes left. It's just over a minute and a half. We're in third at the moment. Slipstreaming gamer down with his hazard lights blaring away. Slight kiss of the wall, that's put me back a bit. Game of down with a 52.6 fastest lap. My best is a 53.2. Can that be any better? No. 54. I've lost my toe. Try not to wall ride. Where are we going to come across the right the line? Much slower. So fifty fours if you're not in a slipstream. Game of Dan is up front, Greg White in second. I've managed to get third, which has really surprised me. I'm surprised that that Cosworth is so off the pace. Really surprised. Uh, Matt Mikey, remember to daily race around here in GT Sport with the Red Bull car, basically flat out all the way around. Yeah, I've, I've been considering doing a Red Bull Junior evening as well. Uh, that's another one that I, I quite fancy. Right, let's um let's get into this one. So we've got Jackie Boy, Ernie Ball, GT Tom, Speedy, Jonesy, Mad Hatter, Welsh Boy, Jenky Racing, myself, Greg White, Gamer Dan, and Drac Fury. We have got a reverse grid. We've got a reverse grid, guys. So we've got the faster cars at the back, the slower cars at the front. How is that going to affect things? We wonder. Good luck, everybody. Woo. Defo, do a Red Bull Junior night. Baz, remind me about that. We'll do it. Keep, keep, keep hassling me. I'd, I'd love to do that something really different look how beautiful this car is really is a beautiful looking car oh i got boxed in
I don't know who that was. Was that Tom or Greg White? One or the others. I got boxed in. I had nowhere to go. Hey Vincent, welcome to the channel. Thank you for subscribing. Welcome to the madness that is PlayStation Racers channel. Well, three wide. Oh, I got hit. I got covered. <laughs> right, let's try and get back into this one. But once you've actually got boost on, so the people that are around the back should catch up fairly quickly I'm going to try and get on the back of GT Tom and give him a bit of a boost where's Greg? Jackie, oh, I can't bump you there. I'll have you around. I was going to try a bump draft, but I think that would have been a little bit too iffy. What I've got to do is try and get on the back of GT Tom. Use this slipstream. We're catching him. Not a great place to catch. Mr. Gear there. Wasn't the corner I thought it was. Whoa. That was a big old moment for me, wasn't it? Big, big moment. I think we've definitely got the parameters right for this one now. Inbound, Greg.
Whoa, I nearly caught that one. Boost is on for this one, Drac. Yeah, one of the few races that I've actually tried boost on. And Slipstream is strong too. Go on, Greg. Go, go, go. Right, let's work together. Oh, Greg, don't lose it, don't lose it. Oh, I had a big old, big old slide at one point, but that was a bit of fun. That was, that was actually pretty good. A lot, lot better than I thought it was going to be. Um, we'll definitely, definitely have to uh, make sure that we update the, the record for that one. So that is record number 29. Let me just bring that up so that I update that one later on. Um... So mechanical damage on that was light, uh, slipstream strength was strong, boost was strong, I think the rest was all okay. That was, that was cool, that was a good one. Right, let's just, um, well, I'll tell you what we're going to do now actually um because we're getting up for 11 o'clock so i'm actually going to come out of the randomizer get the right um get the right button um yes i do want to save changes uh what i'm going to do now is i'm going to head back over to and i apologize for this uh gamer dan thank you very much thank you for racing with us this evening been good been really 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 good um, but I am now going to be indulging myself because we're going to be heading back over to Brands for what I hope will be two races. Uh, one is going to be the main event. And the second one, if I can find the details, is going to be the sprint race which I think is seven laps. Um, we will have to see. How are things going with Kushti at the minute? Um, uh, 
how many has he got running? He's got a few. Give Kushti a little like while I'm in there. Talking about likes, guys, if you haven't already, can you please hit the like button if you haven't already on my video? That will really, really help me a lot. And at the moment, we've got 12 of 16 in this one. So we're not going to get many more people in, actually, if I'm honest. So 12 or 16, Faz is in, Ernie Ball's in, I'm in, Mad Mikey, Jonesy, Jackie Boy, Mr. Theatre, GT Tom. Um, it would be interesting to see um, how many of the runners for tomorrow we are actually going to get. Thirteen at the moment. Yeah, to some guys in a room. So we've got Faz, Ernie Ball, myself, Drak Fury, Malkovich, Mad Mikey, Jonesy, Jackie Boy, Mr. Theatre, GT Tom, Mad Hatter, Jenky, and the Sim Guy are your 13 runners at the moment. I'm not sure what's happening. I don't want to hijack um, Kushti's channel. And it may well be that he's going to be doing exactly the same thing as me. Um, Looks like things are still going well over with Kushti. He's got a nice bunch of guys in there. Who's he got in there with him? He's got um, Shumi's over there. Vancouver. A few of them. Can't see. Too small on my phone. That's pretty, pretty cool. But we have got 13 of 16 in our room. So we're still doing pretty well over here too. It's great to have two streams running at the same time. Really, really good. Um, so we're going to get the qualifier at um, 23. I'm going to do this 2306 just to give people a few minutes just to run. I want to get out on track as well. So let's just get out on track. Uh, what tyres have I got fitted, first of all? And we're going to go full the rear on that let's get out on track just get a feel for this one we had a cracking race earlier on so we're going to do this and then we're going to do the sprint race afterwards hopefully there'll be some guys in the room that will know the parameters for the sprint race I haven't even looked at that one yet. I think it's just on medium tyres. No pit stops or anything. Jenky. Thank you ever so much for the racing this evening, my friend. I look forward to seeing you another night. Are you running in the STCC tomorrow?
Yeah, if I change the suspension tuning, I'm going to wreck my car, Kuro. I'd love to play around with it. It might help you with the Scooby. Yeah, let me just make the change. Um, ugh. So what have we got available to us? Um, is it everything? That basically is everything set. So now people can set their cars up exactly as they're going to run it tomorrow. Cool, I've just set everything. It's people that are running tomorrow will basically set their car up like they're going to have it tomorrow. Uh, Jenky, yes, I am intending to do lobbies afterwards. Um, we're going to be doing GR4 cars basically so that we can start practicing for the following week. But yeah, we're going to be doing GR4 cars throughout the night uh, at various tracks. I don't know which tracks yet. Um, the STCC is going to go on to about nine o'clock ish, maybe half past nine. So I might be a little bit late. Uh, but I'm going to be, the stream will be running from 8 o'clock onwards. So uh, everything will be good. So you'll be able to jump on if I'm still running, see how we're doing. Obviously the room won't be open, my lobby won't be open until I finish with uh, Jackie's lobby. Uh, but as soon as I'm done with that, I'll be open up my own and we can all go racing. It's going to be fun. So we've got 13 in here at the moment. Cool, Jenky, that'll be fine. I look forward to seeing you then, and thanks for the racing of the last couple of nights. You have been brilliant to race with. I absolutely adore racing with you. Uh, we have some great races. I know we bang doors occasionally, the pair of us, but I tell you what, it's always respectful, and um, I just love racing with you. I love racing with everybody, but in particular, there's a, there's a small group of people that I fairly regularly get into tussles with and Jenky's one of them and um, I just I live for those races I absolutely adore them when you get somebody respectful that races hard and won't give an inch it's it's just brilliant it is just outstanding all right let's get this one underway let's go let's go let's go Let's see if we can do as well as we did earlier on. I did expect to be doing this half an hour ago, but never mind. Um, let's not do that. Let's not do that. Um, That was on the grass. Clean these tyres up quickly. And 
then we got our bar slap now. Mad Mike is just set a 128.9. No way. Bend it. How on earth? earth do you do a 128.9 I don't think I've seen anybody break into the 128 so I might be wrong And he's down in the 130s as well. Wow, there's some quick people in here tonight. Didn't do myself any favours there, but wow. Ah, Mikey. You are on fire, my friend. Wow, 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 wow. That is super quick, super quick. I am loving that. Oh, oh. That little 4C is quite a car in Mad Mikey's hands. Malkovich and Ernie Ball are doing well too. Jonesy's up there. He's in fourth. Bats ahead of me in fifth. Kuro's right on my tail. I, Mad Hat is still running. I wouldn't be surprised if he jumps a couple of places. Jackie Boy's still running too. Ooh. Right, guys, can we please um, keep this one? respectful if you do bump somebody just get the pace back and run behind them if you do decide to quit out the race can you please quit into the pits rather than staying at the side of the race track uh, because the yellow flags will become a bit of a problem for some of us um, 
so otherwise good luck everybody let's see how we go one of the things i'm going to do first of all i nearly forgot change my tires just give everybody a moment or two just to finalize their setups and then we'll get this one going in a moment Mad Hatter is one of DDR's fastest. Mm. Yes. Yes, I'm just looking. Let me just look at that. Mad Mikey at 128.9. Look at it. The next best was Malkovich with a 130.2. Mad Mikey, two seconds ahead. Ernie Ball with a 135, Jonesy with a 136, Baz with a 137. Look how close that is. Really, really close up front. This is going to be interesting. Right. Mad Mikey shucks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my word. Right, guys. Mad Mikey is the car to beat. Wow, I can't believe that. I can't believe that time. That's blown me away. Hi, Ariel. Welcome this evening, my friend. Okay, foot on a break. Quick check. I really should be doing this with the traction control off, but for the moment I've got it on just for a little bit of um, just a little bit of reassurance. As we progress through this series, I'm hoping to get to the point where I'm not running with it on. What have I managed to do so much damage to my bar spinning there?
It's going good, Emsy. Well, it was going good, except I've just spun it. So I'm in a little bit of a catch-up mode here. I'm just considering a slight slight um, pit stop change but I don't know whether it's going to work on the old fuel that's my problem so I might just stick to Kuro's out why is Kuro out? be a penalty yeah I thought it might just cut that a little bit too tight such a good race earlier and this one is rubbish oh. since since though since the labo whatever that is um you need to be a friend or a friend of a friend to find the lobby uh, but basically it's just um, PlayStation Racer it begins with but you will either need to be a friend of mine or a friend of a friend if you want to send me a friend request I'll gladly accept it after this race Oh, where was the yellow flag? I didn't see a yellow flag out. When it goes wrong, guys, it really goes wrong.
This is going to be hero to zero time, this is. We've got a second place in the last one. I'm not powerful, I'm going to be last in this one. Gonna really need to get a wriggle on now. If you need my PSN number, if you type PSN in the chat, it will give you my PSN address or name or whatever it is. Come on. Thank you for jumping out the way Tom but you should have fought that one Mad Mikey in the pits nearly a minute ahead of me that's how bad my race has gone absolutely terrible this one I don't have one like this tomorrow that could be a penalty too I'm absolutely trying to push every single track limit I can at the moment to try and get in the game on this one okay I'll have a look after this race if I forget just do that PlayStation Racer in the chat and remind me. It's when I'm racing and I'm in the zone, I have a brain like a f beer. All right, Jonesy, six down the line. he might be six seconds down the road and I've got this penalty to serve now She's back out of 5.6 again.
Oh, somebody's in the wall. It's Jonesy. Be in the wall there. So we're now chasing down Malkovich. He's 18 seconds down the road. Well, I can't see that happening anytime soon. We'll just see if we can close up at all. Right, that should be accepted. My race was goosed anyway, so I just uh I'd accept that and let's go chase fast. Right, got bounced out to 2.6, 2.7. It's a little bit quicker than me down the straight. But uh, 
I'm not really closing on him enough at this stage in the race. Hi, Body Edits. We just got a GL4 car. Whoa, bring it racing. It's got fast down to 2.2, but. We close him, but just not fast enough. Tried a new line through there, didn't really work. Yeah, I'll be on tomorrow. I'm doing a um, championship race between eight and nine, not half nine, something along those lines, and then we'll be lobby racing afterwards in the GR4s. My right front tyre is nearly gone. Really been leaning on it a lot more than I would normally. Plus I've had a few spins. So it's not been a great race for me this one. Usually a little bit better on my tyres. I've just been pushing so hard to try and catch up with Faz, but just struggling a little bit to uh, close the gap it's ebbing and flowing ever so slightly at the moment Right, don't get in Faz's way. Thank you, mate. Whoa. Pushing this so hard. Using all the track limits and more. But I think Faz has got the better of me here yeah, on the gravel now. He can cruise this to the end. Well done, Faz. Well done, my friend. Just didn't have enough on the day. I've used too much of my front tyres. Hey, Mr. Theatre, they can't all be good. I had a bad one there. I got a second place first time we ran that earlier on today with some stiff competition and sixth in that one. That was not good. Not good at all. I tell you now, that 86 is a car I struggle with. Um, this Sylvia is a brilliant GR4 car around here. And the 4C that Mad Mikey is in, he is absolutely cooking it in that one. Absolutely rocking it. Baz, I had the same problem, my friend. I, I burnt my tyres out too much trying to catch you or sliding it around way way too much uh had to ladder did the same to try and save the tires i had to had to right okay so is kura around is it seven laps for the sprint race
I, go, I don't know what the tyre wear is, whether it's 6 and 6, 65 litres. Um, I don't know what the what the settings are for the, the sprint. Seven laps mediums. What about the fuel situations, guys? Okay, Matt's just going to go check. Thank you. Unfortunately, I can't come out of here and check stuff. Otherwise, I'll bump everybody out. To Sim Guy, thanks for the race, guys, and a lovely community. Until next time, thank you ever so much for dropping in, my friends. Smack the like button if you wouldn't mind on the way out. Look after yourself, and I'll see you again very, very soon, I hope. Uh, but for now... Um, Jack McCall, thanks for the racing tonight. He's going to head off. Thank you ever so much for racing with us. Uh, this is going to be my last one for tonight. Um, I don't know if Kushti is still running. Uh, but thank you to those of you that uh, headed off and supported Kushti uh, as well. We've had uh, two streams running and two lobbies running side by side tonight, which has been really great. Just check in with him and see how things are going. Looks like he's still running. Still running. A few people in there at the moment. Although they're heading over to the... Um, heading over to Brands. Doesn't say, so I think the same settings. That was my problem. Should we, um, I'm going to make some assumptions because he says it's a sprint race. So I'm going to put this to um, just default. And I'm going to take the fuel consumption and the tire wear off. He does say it's a sprint race. And normally sprint races would just be straight run. So that's what I'm going to go with. So we give this a whirl. Oh, Drac, I've just changed it. He wants sports tyres. Um, a lot of us are, are practising this for tomorrow. So um, I'm, I'm just going to leave it with racing tyres at the moment. Yeah, I don't know which... Would well, you think it'd be on a smaller track? I'll tell you what I might be able to do. Let me just check one thing. Let me just check one thing. Uh, where's Kuro? Where's Kuro, 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 Kuro? Where are you? Right, in here, I should have, where is it? Bear with me a second, guys. I'm just trying to check something out. Round two, reverse grid sprint. Um, where is it? Where is it? There it is. Google Docs. Um, schedule. Uh, Brands Hatch GP. So it's a, the Grand Prix. Seven laps medium. And it's six and six. So the... Wow. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. I'm glad I checked. I'm glad I checked. 
the fuel and the tires guys are the same it's six and six that's throwing me he's still going six and six on this wow Yeah, Matt, I've just checked. It's not. I've just checked in the, the Google Doc that he did. And it's the Grand Prix circuit. And we're still six and six on tyre wear and fuel, which has really surprised me. I did not think that that would be the case, uh, if I'm perfectly honest. I'm assuming that we are um, still the same with regards to um, not having to stop. That has just surprised me. Yeah, Jonesy, I know. That's that's what surprised me too. That's thrown me a little bit. We'll, we'll go with what the paperwork says. And we'll just see, see what the score is. Let me just make sure I read that right. So, um, 22nd of March, race round two, Brands Hatch GP, circuit... The thing is, it's circuit length 1.2. I think that I think the spreadsheet's wrong. I think the spreadsheet is wrong. It is. The spreadsheet's wrong. Kuro, are you listening? I don't know if you're listening or whether you're on Christie's channel still. Reverse grid sprint, seven laps, racing mediums six and six tires but it's got to be the other track oh, sorry guys this is a little bit confusing i'm going to go with the tire wear on because that's going to be worst case scenario if he doesn't do tire wear then it's going to be easier so let's go with the worst case scenario But I'm suspecting it's, it's got to be the Indy because it's got here in 1.2 miles, which is the Indy track. It's got to be this one. It has to be this one. Right, I am going to head out just to do a lap or two because now although I've got to grips with the brand circuit, the Indy circuit is not one that I know. I'm hoping it's a quick one to learn. Where's well where, where's the track go? Wow, that's a tight corner. Hi Larson, how you doing my friend? I've seen you for a while.
Yeah, Mad Mike, it's um, I'm confused. But it definitely says 1.2 miles, which indicates to me that it is the short circuit. But I can't quite work out why we've got um, tire and fuel, because normally for a sprint, you just go for it. Thanks, Drac. Oh. Right, let's just see where we are with this. This is going to take some getting used to. Okay, we're all in it. Let's just let's just start the quality and just see what happens. Uh, so, Matt Mikey says, I think this needs or needed to be confirmed before. Uh, it doesn't seem that clear. I would say that sounds right for the seven lap around the circuit on racing mediums. All it says is half distance on RM. So is it is it seven? The problem is if you look at the um, the spreadsheets that he did, one of them says the track limit or the track length is 1.2 miles. And the Indy circuit is 1.2 miles. So does it mean that we're doing the Grand Prix circuit or are we doing the Indy circuit? Kuro, yes. Um, for the race tomorrow, are we doing it for the sprint race? Are we doing the Indy circuit or are we doing the Grand Prix circuit? Because the spreadsheet is confusing. It says Grand Prix circuit, but he says 1.2 miles. And 1.2 miles is the Indy circuit. I need to be qualifying. I'm getting in everybody's way. Um, so we're a bit confused. Also, for a sprint race, you wouldn't normally have fuel and tyre wear on. But again, the spreadsheet says six and six. So I'm not sure if there's something wrong in the spreadsheet. We're actually running the Indy circuit as a race in a moment, and I'm not sure if that is correct or not. I didn't know if you knew. I know it's not your event, but you're normally in the know with these things. <laughs> Okay, so we are doing the wrong track. Fiddlesticks. I got a bit confused because he's got the track length in there and he's got it at 1.2, which is the same distance as the Indy. So I made a de I made the unilateral decision that it would be the Indy track. Oh well, never mind.
Thanks, Kuro. Appreciate it. Personally, I don't mind the tyre and fuel on because that then replicates real world. Uh, it was just really the uh, which track it was, whether it was the Indy track or whether it was the um, the Grand Prix track. Oh, one minute I get that corner right, the next minute I get it all wrong. I don't see a problem with it either, my friend. I do not see a problem with it whatsoever. The main thing, I, I just wasn't sure which track it was. That was my, my conundrum, was the track. Mr. Theatre, good evening. Have a nice evening, night, whatever. Thank you for joining us this evening. And uh, Kuru, thanks again for straightening stuff out. And as I said, I, I actually quite like having tyre and fuel wear in races full stop. Because it, you know, you, you can't go out in a real world and run a car without burning up tyres and fuel. Um, me too, Kuro. Me too. Oh, I went away with the other car on the left hand side of me. Crikey, talk about side-by-side -side racing. I don't know who's on the inside of me, but we are side-by-side -side all the way through this. GT Tom. Hi Big Baba, thank you for joining the uh, channel and for subscribing. <laughs> Robber B, you want me to change the tyres too. I refused to do that, but um, no, I only changed the track layout because I saw 1.2 and I assumed that the track length was correct and that the um, simply the track name had been pulled down so I just made the assumption it was the indie track it's going to be good if it's on the same track the Grand Prix track just with the uh, medium tyres and uh, no pit stop and stuff 
especially as I can't get to grips with this track. I keep overshooting that uh, the new corner. Oh, this is a battle and a half with Jonesy. Swapping places like you wouldn't believe. in the gravel Bobber. and now I've got dirty tyres let's hope it's not the indie circuit tomorrow So that means we've got to do one more race. Mad Hatter, what a move for the wind. Sounds like there was some good racing going on up ahead. Uh, Big Bubba, glad to be here. I'm new to the game. I also have a PSVR 2 and I love it. Never got into racing games before. I wish I did now. I'm addicted. Well, welcome to the stream, my friend. Go and grab a GR4 and come race with us. Have you got your you got your PlayStation running? This is going to be the last one for me. We're going to do seven laps of the Grand Prix circuit. Well done, how to well done, well done, well done. Okay, no worries, Big Bubba. We'll be lobby racing tomorrow night and then we'll be back with normal randomised lobby racing on Monday. I stream from nine o'clock UK time in the evening until whenever. Um, so we will edit the settings 
Uh, load the settings. So I want branch hatch. We need to go. Um, all the settings are the same. same they're all the same seven laps not 14 theoretically that is now what we're doing I'm gonna need to treat myself to some new gloves soon I'm gonna try and race this one without gloves Oh. oh, excuse me. Yours truly was going to finish at 11 o'clock this evening. It's going to be half past 12 before we finish. This is definitely, definitely, definitely my last one. Uh, it looks like the last race that we just did was a bit of a time waster, I'm afraid, guys. Apologise for that. But... If we do head off to the Indy track, at least we're going to know roughly what it's like. And I'm going to get this one underway as soon as everybody's in the car. Oh, manual transmission is a big step up. So much better. So, so much better. Um, Jack, no, we should be on private. Should be friends only. It should be friends only, but I've had a lot of people have requested to be friends with me. And there's a lot of friends of friends that are finding us this week. I think because of this brand hatch thing. And there's also a fair bit of talk about the channel online. I'm getting a, a, a fair number of people contacting me on social media saying, can they come along and race with us? And they heard about me from this person and that person. Uh, Drac, I'm assuming it is. I don't know. Um, I've got the fuel in at 6.6. 6. That is what the spreadsheet says. Um... I'm just waiting for synth and then we'll get going. Yep, 9010 it is. I wanted to finish at 11. Um, but uh, we wanted to do the branch hatch one last time. And then I might have just messed up because I loaded up the indie track. But it looks like it's the Grand Prix track that we're running. Um... Synth, it should just be any GR4 car. Any GR4 car. Because there's no restrictions. Is it wide body? Please don't tell me you put a wide body on it. I bet it's got a wide body. Hmm. Porsche Cayman. I don't think that's, that's not a GR4 car. It's not a GR4. I 
Uh, it's oh, actually, it's a GT4 Club Sport. That one would work. You got racing tyres on it. I can get in with mine. Needs to be racing mediums. You need racing medium tyres. As you can see on the screen, I've got in with mine. There we go. There we go. Right, I'm going straight into this one. You're welcome, my friend. That's what we're here for. We are here to help and educate. We all had to start somewhere. And I still mess up all the time, so I shouldn't worry about it. Mind you, you haven't messed up, you're just learning. I mess up. Well, Blades had a nice racial cushy. Cool beans, my friend. How did things go over on Cushy's channel? Was it good? He ran with flat tires and you kept up. <laughs> it was good to have two um, two lobbies and two streams running at the same time. It gave people choice, which is good. I still remain busy over here. Oh, cool. I'd like to drop him a thank you note in a minute. the pack get out of the way oh fiddlesticks bother mad hatter i'm sorry i was just completely out of control couldn't hold it i'm really sorry Ah, no worries. Thanks, Christy. Thank you so much for stepping in. That really worked well tonight. How many did you have in your room in the end?
cool. That's good. I'm glad you had a few people in there. This is a whole different kettle of fish on the mediums. I don't know, I think we'll had a good time racing with you. He just mentioned he was racing with you at the end there and I bet he's probably learnt a lot. He probably learnt more than me. Just probably gone a little bit too late tiredness setting in. You got your VR running. What's the VR like, Orb? Is it good? I'm so resisting getting a VR set. I really, really want to. Amazing is everything they say it is. Oh, no, don't say that to me. <laughs> oh, the problem is it's I spend 90% of my time in the game streaming and it's very difficult to stream with VR. Yeah, exactly as Christy's just said. Um, you can't see through to chat, you're completely blind. Um, what it needs is it needs a little switch where you can actually go and see through it to your chat and then come back in the game. I will go that route at some point, I will go that route. Uh, but like I said, 90% of the time uh, um, I'm racing with you guys. Oh, you can see through it, but it's all black and white. Yeah, it's, it's, I've watched a few live streams where somebody's sitting with, with the headset on and it just seems a little bit impersonal and disjointed and I've noticed that quite a few of the big streamers have um, come away from it. Yeah. Right, here we go, guys. Let's see how we go. I'm getting a little bit tired for this one, so if I bump anybody, I apologise. Um, just getting a little bit tired.
could do with a pit stop really get myself some distance fortunately it's not going to happen at the moment Boy, this is manic. I think Mad Hatter got roughed up there a little bit. Oh, well held, Jonesy. Messed up there, big time. Running right close up behind people is still one of my big problems. Um, I need to work on that a lot, lot more. I lose too many races doing that. 
so um, yeah it's just something I'm gonna need to really 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 work on if I'm going to get better and quicker it's like when you're out in clean air you can take your own lines you've got loads of time to look for your breaking points when you're tucked up behind somebody else everything's all happening so much quicker in my mind and I don't react fast enough and then that gets me into into difficulties as you just saw oh gonna I think uh, I need to I need to carry on with this one I don't really want to jack it in but I'm uh, struggling with this one Be okay tomorrow i think it's just tiredness setting a little bit and it's always the same when i get tired i make one or two little mistakes which is basically what i'm doing now my brake balance is good it's right to the rear which is how I'm running it for the race and actually finding this car really nice with the brake balance full to the rear but don't tell the others that because a lot of them are already copying my strategy I don't think you probably need the brake balance full to the rear with the medium tyres because they don't wear the same as the softs. But I've just got used to that feel of dragging the back end of the car through the corners. One more to go. love to sit behind Drac and watch him showboating but unfortunately got to get to grips with this car for tomorrow on these tyres so there's no fuel issues we can go all the way on the fuel oh well, that was a poor 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 race Hopefully that's just tiredness kicking in.
hopefully just tighten this but early ball well done in the Lexus Malkovich in second Jonesy third Manhattan fourth I got fifth Drac was showboating GT Tom is seventh uh, Synth in eighth and Bones was a DNA um, is it Ernie's birthday well happy birthday Ernie happy happy birthday happy birthday to you happy birthday to you happy birthday dear Ernie happy birthday to you there's some beers for you my friend there's some beers for you I can't find something else that's reasonable. Looking for something like a birthday cake or something. Can't find one. Never mind. Happy birthday, my friend. Happy birthday, happy birthday, happy birthday. Right. Guys, that is it for me for this evening. Um, except it isn't. Except it isn't because we need to do the winners. We need to do the winners. I was so rubbish in that one. I was going to skip over the winners. Only Ball was your winner with a 130.6. Malkovich in second with a 130.9. Jonesy in third with a 131.3. Matt Hatter in fourth. I managed to get fifth, but with the one second penalty. Jack Fury was showboating in sixth. GT Tom in seventh and Synth in eighth. Bones was a DNF. So your top three, Ernie Ball, Malkovich and Jonesy. Congratulations to you all. And with that, I am going to go back to this camera and I am going to wish you all well. Ernie, I hope you have the best, best birthday ever. And hopefully we'll catch up with you towards the end of your birthday tomorrow evening. For now, I am way, way later than I wanted to be. And I've got a busy day tomorrow and also we've got this race that's happening at eight o'clock tomorrow the stcc uh with um with the guys over on playwrights i believe it's playwrights channel who's hosting it and uh jackie is running the show uh we've got a bit of a surprise with regards to the track tomorrow night um hopefully it's going to be the grand prix track wasn't too much of a fan of the other one we shall see uh, but that's all kicking off at eight o'clock. So I'll be streaming just before eight o'clock tomorrow night, streaming the whole of that STCC race that I'm entered into. Hopefully I won't crash. I'll be very, very quiet. And then we'll be heading into the lobby races as soon as that's finished. So that's what's happening tomorrow. Join me then. In the meantime, stay well, stay safe. Give the video a like if you haven't already. If you're new around here, please consider subscribing. Ernie Ball, have a cracking birthday and I will see all of you tomorrow. For now, take care. Bye-bye.